Hey guys, it's Vin17, we're back from the video, and today I'm going to be going over some upcoming updates to Mattable 23. Before we do start, make sure to leave a like on the video, join my Discord server, link will be in the description, and let's try to get 100 likes on this video, that'd be awesome. The post notification shout out, because this person on the screen right there, thank you for having your post notifications on. If you guys do want a post notification shout out, make sure to be subscribed, have notifications on, be one of the first people to comment on one of my videos, and let's get straight into this. Of course, all of this was revealed on the official uh, Twitch stream, uh, you know, they always stream Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. They're not streaming this Thursday. Uh, there will be a promo reveal tomorrow. I'll have that video out um, as well, but uh, let's get straight into all the updates. All right, guys, I did forget to mention we're only about 400 subscribers away from 16K. So, again, a subscription uh, would really mean a ton. And uh, let's get straight into uh, the stream notes. So, there will be a force update tomorrow uh, at 1130. Um, for the new Team of the Week players, uh, we have a Javon Hargrave. Don't quite know how to feel about that. I mean, I feel like my guy Justin Fields uh, definitely deserves it. He definitely carved us up. Uh, we're lucky that, you know, we clutched up and got the win. But uh, Fields, I mean, he, I, in my opinion, at least an epic. I mean, he broke like a record or something for rushing yards by a quarterback, which is pretty insane. So uh, shout out to Fields, shout out to Bears fans. But um, yeah, we did get a Javon Hargrave. I mean, he also balled out on Thursday night. So I mean, I guess it's okay. Um, and then we also have Dwayne Smoot from the Jags and Kirby Joseph from the Lions uh, as the client update information. Now, uh, we did have an update yesterday as well. I you know, made a video going over all the uh, changes, but that was pretty much just visual stuff in my eyes. This is actually like going to be you know behind the game. So uh, there were also lots of high level bug fixes and changes. Season goals were fixed. Updates to iconic foil animations. Um, I, I actually didn't know that. I haven't uploaded or I haven't uh, opened, I should say, an Iconic pack in quite some time. So uh, I didn't notice an update today. Um, and of course, uh, adjustments to league reward distribution, etc. There are some additional changes that will take effect during future promos. It's kind of cool to hear. Uh, I'm going to go over this, uh, you know, like very briefly. I'm pr probably going to make a video on it later on. So you can read that if you want. Uh, leagues info. Uh, LVL is going back to 1 p.m. EST tomorrow. Elite tier difficulty will be tuned, but likely won't happen until after the next client update. Intra-league difficulty is being looked at. So, you know, there's your league's info if you're into that. Uh, not too bad right there. And here's just some other stuff. Fitzpatrick one-upping Vic was not the desired outcome. That sort of thing will not happen again. Uh, no updates on any possible foil trade-ins. So, if, you know, you have foils sitting on your bench. It's not ideal, uh, in my opinion. New drills are still being worked on. We'll start being... Uh, will start showing up here in the next couple months uh again nothing about um the new game modes or anything like that i mean which is pretty disappointing so i stand by my theory that we're not going to get one um you know they're just saying it but hopefully they prove me wrong there um but this information you know is pretty nice uh we're getting another i guess client update so um i guess you know just make sure to update your game uh around 11 30 a.m tomorrow um it might even auto update i'm not you know really sure but uh that's gonna be it guys uh just some like i said very minor updates but uh thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you in the next one and peace out